you guys welcome back to my channel i am adore lyric um so you guys i am actually just going ahead and putting some leave-in conditioner on my hair using the dew um the same leave-in that i've been using for quite a while now i'm just detangling with my felicia leatherwear brush um i'm just gonna go ahead and detangle my head um and just go ahead and put some two strand twists to separate everything as i'm doing this um and then i'll go ahead and blow out my hair prior to um trimming um because i find that it is a lot easier that way obviously i'm not a beautician you guys so i don't really know what i'm doing i just know how to survive and keep my natural hair looking good for the most part um so i will be showing you guys how i do uh, trim my hair um so just keep watching while you guys continue continue to see me um separate my hair and then go ahead and apply the leave-in and detangle Gonna be using my uh, yellow bird blow dryer um, so I go ahead and I separate the items that I've already kind of tangled already because it's a lot easier to do it this way I promise y'all I am the most awkward person when I blow dry any of my hair I hold it so weirdly but it gets the job done but um, so I just go ahead and blow out each section first and then you will um, kind of see me going back in with my Felicia Leatherwood brush. Um, here I'm just showing you guys what my ends look like. They're not too terrible but you can see that they aren't completely um, clean and clear cut. Um, therefore that's why I want to do the trim. So I'm just going to keep uh, blow drying each section out and keeping it separated. Um, and then I'll go ahead and show you guys towards the end um, how I'll be trimming my hair. Essentially I just cut off you know what is necessary. I don't do any any more any less um, I just want to make sure that I can continue to keep my hair from too growing um, instead of breaking and things like that and just making sure my twist outs look nice full and clean and then the ends aren't too ratty um, also my hair is uneven so I'm working to try to get it back um, even again but um, that's another story for another day so let's continue to watch and then we'll get to the trimming in a second This is a before I even go ahead and put any of the scissors to my head. I'm super loving this look. Actually, I wanted to wear it out like this, but I decided not to because it was really late anyway. <laughs> um, but I always dream of actually going outside like this or just styling it kind of like blown out like this. I can never get it any straighter, um, but I still like how puffy it is. Kind of, It is blown out, but it's still not too, too straight, so I'm used to the volume. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and start trimming my hair. Um, I keep giving you guys all these spin arounds because clearly I'm loving it. So I'm just going to go ahead and section off the back of my hair. Um, Y'all know I can't see the back of my head so <laughs> bear with me as that part is super crooked. Um, so I section off the back part. I'm separating and detangling again with my Felicia Leatherwood brush and then I'm just kind of placing my fingers towards the bottom. Um, and again I'm just going to cut exactly what I feel is unnecessary or did on my hair. Um, nothing more so I'm just clearly kind of going towards the bottom of that and then just cutting just a bare minimum off of what I need. Um, nothing more guys or nothing less than that. Once you just clip, you know, exactly what you need off, you can put your fingers through it just to see, you know, the difference, kind of how your finger doesn't get caught when you're putting your fingers through it. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and move to the middle section. The same thing, you can see the ends, how puffy they are, um, and they're typically harder for me to kind of put my fingers through or even have like a good twist out. So that's why I just want to cut off exactly what isn't necessary or what may be getting caught up or causing my, my twist out to look 
not as bomb um, and then this also kind of helps with your hair from growing um, if your hair if your ends are not clipped then obviously your hair won't grow as well um, so just cut off exactly what you need and I just kind of eyeball it and just kind of use my finger to um, go down and just kind of see the bare minimum use that as like a guard as well um, so then once you're done you'll be able to put your fingers through so again here's another one um, so I just put my fingers all the way down to the closest point where I think I should cut and then go from there I really hope this is making sense, um, especially having a visual. I hope it helps too. So just put your fingers, slide it all the way down to that section, um, and then kind of use that as a placement to know where you should cut your ends off at and just cut the very bare minimum. Um, I'm not cutting for a style or anything. I'm just cutting for hair growth and just to make sure that my hair is healthy. Um, so I'm just going to cut exactly what the way that I told y'all and I actually skipped over that top section because um, we're not going to talk about that but one time I cut a little too much before I actually realized what I was doing so I skipped over that part because that's my problem area but I'm moving to the other side now I'm just going to continue that same technique um, and then just cutting just a bare bare minimum off you guys using my finger as a guard and placement to know exactly where to cut um, and then that's it and then I'll finish that with the rest of my hair. All right, y'all, this is it. I know it's no secret that my hair is uneven. I promise y'all I'm going to get it right. And then when I do, I'll let y'all know how it looks. But this is the final um, look after my hair and my ends are clipped and back to a healthy fro. Um, so I'll be able to go for it with all of my twist outs looking a little bit better. Um, so, yeah, thanks you guys for watching and I hope you learned something. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I know it was super short, but I hope you still enjoyed it and love to see my hair all blown out because I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to comment, don't forget to come back next week, next Friday, bitch. Next week, next Friday, bitch. Next Friday, bitch. <laughs> All right, it's really hot in the back. I gotta go. Thanks, guys. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to subscribe. Come back. I'll see y'all later. Bye.